Okay, so I was getting ready to do my makeup and I thought, wow, look at all this plastic. It's my Ghetto Fabulous uh, makeup box thing here. Um, so, again, we've got stuff that's disposable-ish. Like, this is a makeup setting spray. It's half gone. I've had it for about a month. Um, this says it's recyclable, but it's still plastic. And then there's things like this concealer. This is going to last me about a year. It's plastic. Um, liquid foundation. This is glass. Top of it is plastic. The lid is plastic. Um, I always try to recycle these, but I'm not sure if it happens because there's always residue. Um, stuff like you know, these are kind of a lot of elf stuff. These are lip glosses. Um, I plow through these fast. These might last a month or two. All plastic. These are made in China too. Um, some stuff like liquid eyeliner. This lasts a long time. Stuff like brushes. You know, these three brushes I absolutely love. I'll probably have them for years. And the bristles, they're cheap. They're some sort of fibery plastic. Um, and some, well, probably all three of these have plastic and metal. Um, uh, whatever that's called, <laughs> the handles. And yeah, there's just other stuff. Palettes, plastic. The things that eyelashes come in, plastic. Um, just kinds of stuff. This BB cream, BB cream. All plastic. Is that made in China? Made in Canada. Oh, whatever. Plastic. Um, so, you know, almost every single item. And, you know, I'm not going to get rid of the stuff that I already have, but I'm going to try hard not to buy any more. And, uh, it's going to be really flippin' difficult. Because I'm just seeing more and more. Looking around my room right now, I'm seeing more and more stuff. Pens. Try buying a non-plastic pen without spending big bucks. I mean, it's just, it's ridiculous. It's absolutely gotten out of control. And so, stick with me for this incredibly frustrating experiment. I'll let you know how it goes. Thanks.